So what's good, TMG fam? It's your boy L, and I'm back with another reaction. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel. Salute, man. So, when it comes to extraterrestrial things, who do you call? Huh? You got something going on in your house, something strange happening? Who do you call? Definitely not me. I, I, I didn't want y'all to be mistaken that I wanted you to call me. Don't call me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Ghostbusters, uh, uh, Bizarre Bub, who we about to watch the video from, um, 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 Slapped Ham, um, Mr. Nightmare, um, all these guys deal with this type of stuff. What's, what's another channel? Uh, um, top five. Yeah, yeah. Most amazing. Uh, not, not, what, what's the other? I can't remember right now, but yeah, don't call me. But if you want us to review the footage of your paranormal, then you hit us up. That's where we come in. We're not there to solve it. We're there to react to it. That's, it's two different things. You know what I mean? But anyway, definitely shout outs to Bizarre Bub for the video. This is Scary Compilation Volume 46. All right? So if you're new, hit the subscribe button. Join the fam. Make sure the house is secure. The lights is dim. Before we get to it, let's go. Who's watching over her child through a baby monitor when she... What? The following video shows a mother who's watching over her child through a baby monitor when she notices something disturbing. The mother writes, My 10-month-old son was taking a nap. I checked on him via the baby monitor and noticed something odd. I have no idea what I caught on camera, but I'm still freaked out. This is what she caught. What the hell is this thing? First of all, what's pissing me off right now is, so you're just gonna stand there and look at it instead of running to your child's aid? What the, what thought process is that? Not trying to bash it. I'm just saying though, bro. You gonna stand here on a baby monitor and watch it? Like, what is that? Oh my gosh, there's something in my child's room. I don't know what that is. It could be dangerous to my child. What the? Cameron. Still there. Maybe she don't went and looked already. I'm hoping. And she was just like, I went, check, now I'm recording. Maybe that's what happened. You know what I'm saying? Because most of us, we not sitting there looking on no screen. We're going to check it out. In between the bars of the crib, there appears to be a face, and it seems to be watching over the child as it sleeps. The mother then proceeds to walk over to her son's room to see what it is that's on camera. I don't even like that delayed response, bro. No, lady, but you're so nonchalant. Make sure the child is still in there. Child could be gone about how long it took you to get in there. There's nothing there. Whoever, or whatever this was, doesn't appear to be inside the room. The mother checks all over the place, but doesn't find anyone or anything inside. Now, this could be a case of pareidolia. The face seen on the monitor could have been a toy or some object. Perhaps it was the playmat next to the crib. But the mother states that it couldn't have been the playmat, as the face was still there even after moving it. This one's pretty creepy. I can't think of anything to explain this, but maybe you can. I'll leave it to you to figure this one out. Rewatch the clip and see what you think. Ain't nothing to figure out. Just know my child won't be sleeping in there, ever. 
This next video doesn't have much info, but it speaks for itself. The person who's recording this appears to be inside their home, but right from the start, you can tell that there's something wrong. They're walking very carefully towards a bedroom. They seem to be cautious and also scared. We have no idea as to why they're frightened. But then, all of a sudden, this happens. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you. Show us what's in there. Show. I dare you. Show us what's in there. Because if it's empty, bro, you better run. Go. 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 Do it. Do it. Those who've seen the yo, whoa, whoa, I wanted him. Y'all saw how bad I was chanting for him to walk in there and show us. He walked in there and showed us, bro. My heart just dropped. Like, holy, like, oh, oh I, that, once I showed everybody, I'd have ran up out of there. Footage believe that a poltergeist was caught on camera. It's not certain if that's the case, though. It could be that someone had hid in the closet after causing this mess. However, if someone was hiding inside, how were they able to move the papers on the bed? Viewers find the video to be genuine, but of course, I'll let you decide if it is. Doubtless, the video itself is pretty creepy. Yeah, now that he say that, I definitely want to see what's in the other closets, but I definitely don't blame him for wanting to open <laughs> the other closets. You got to think about that side of it too. You know what I mean? You see how how his how his breathing was during that? He was he was building up the courage to walk around that corner and look in that cabinet. So you think he finna man, he might pass out trying to open that darn clock that that door. There's a channel on YouTube called Sheikah the Cat, and it used to have lots of videos of a cat named Sheka. But for some reason, Chica's owner has taken down all videos from the channel, except for three. As it turns out, the owner has been experiencing strange activity at home. And so, he's decided to dedicate the channel to these odd occurrences. The three videos that are left are footage of strange happenings. Here's one of them. trying to watch the door and the cat. The cat go give us confirmation. Cat go like that? Okay, then it's confirmed. Get, get out of there. Now there haven't been any uploads recently. This is because the owner has moved out of the house. No one knows why he moved out, but some think that it might be because the activity got intense. But, after hearing about this, a man named Muguro had bought the house. He was very interested in the cat owner's story and wanted to investigate the place. So, after moving in, he sets up a few cameras around the house, including a motion detecting system that alerts his phone. Mm -hmm. Once everything had been set up, he begins to record. Now initially, nothing happens on the first night he stays there, but then, on November 20th of 2021, 
As he sleeps, something happens. This is what he caught. sleeper I might not have heard that again now I'm waking up that could be outside though that sound like inside Somebody in your walls, fam. Somebody in your walls, bro. It's in your walls. I think that's his pipes or something. <laughs> I don't know. At this point, I'm grasping for, for some reason. You think it's the pipes? Or what, what do y'all think? Maguru wakes up to a noise coming from the closet. To his surprise, nothing is there when he opens it. But then, Maguru hears a noise coming from downstairs. He checks the bathroom and thinks that the noise might be coming from inside the tub. Now, it could be that a leaky pipe or some other pipe problem is making this noise. However, on the 25th of November, Muguro captures something that the pipes could not have caused. Muguro cannot explain this footage. Bro, bro making that type of noise, if it's your pipes, Somebody's stealing your pipes, dude. <laughs> you know what I mean? You might have like the local crackhead out there stealing your pipes and stuff, fam. Now that could be a draft, bro. You might have a draft. Where's the vent? Where's the closest vent? The closet door moves on its own. Maguro doesn't know what to make of this. But what occurs on November 28th has left him baffled. As if things couldn't get any more unsettling, this happens. No chance of detected in the bathroom.
That wasn't a walk away. That was a dis. Y'all saw that, right? I, my eyes ain't tripping. The bathroom door closes on its own. But even more disturbing, there appears to be a white silhouette manifesting inside the inner bathroom. It then disappears seconds later. Muguro hadn't noticed this until watching the footage later. He is now certain that the house is haunted. He has yet to upload more videos of strange occurrences. But for now, viewers find his latest evidence compelling. But until more evidence is given, it's hard to be certain if it's real or not. Hmm. So, that being said, be sure to stay tuned for updates. You can check out the channel Fourth Wall for more info on this story. If you caught something creepy on camera, or if there's any ghost videos you'd like me to check out and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. That being said, let's get back to the video. Perhaps the scariest thing besides living in a haunted home is the toll it takes on your mental health. You're always on edge in a place meant to be your safe space. Lee is someone who's been experiencing this for a while, and it was just recently that he caught footage of something pretty disturbing. Lee wakes up in the middle of the night after hearing noises in the attic when he captures the following on camera. This is what he caught. Lee captures what sounds like footsteps coming from his attic. See, I don't like how it don't be. It, it, sometimes it just don't feel realistic to me what they be doing. You know what I mean? <laughs> Most of us, if we get up, we hear something, we come into the, we come into the door armed and, and ready. Somebody might have a bat. Somebody might have, you know what I mean, some melts. I just, it'd be crazy to me that, that they just walk out there with nothing in their hands, just, just listening. Then what you gonna do, run back and get your weapon? Nah, nah. He decides just make it real. To check it out, thinking that someone had broken into his house. However, he- And he's still barehanded. He doesn't find anyone inside. He then proceeds to sit by the stairs and continue recording. But what happens next has left him spooked. Whoever's here, making all that sound, speak on this device. If you've got the balls, tell me your name. Tell me your name clearly. A disembodied voice is recorded after asking for the supposed entity's name. Lee is absolutely certain that something is dwelling in his home. Has Lee captured evidence of something paranormal? Or is it something else? Reddit user Lupaz had posted the following image and writes, My spouse says she has felt a presence in our apartment, making noises and stuff. I've heard them as well, but I have always convinced myself that there was a logical explanation to it all, until the stupid Snapchat screenshot was taken. It was taken in the afternoon, right after I came home from work and got out of the shower. When I went into the bedroom to get some clothes on, I opened my spouse's Snapchat and just took a quick selfie replying, no you. She immediately screenshotted the snap and sent it back to me with, what is that behind you? I was stunned about what I saw and went back to the bedroom where I couldn't see anything abnormal at all. <laughs> that has got to be one of the weirdest texts to receive, bro. What is that behind you? 
that's when you get like one of those movie scenes where you start to turn around and look slowly. <laughs> this is what he caught. What the f They better have a kid and that kid better have a sense of humor and that kid better have a mask that look like that. A face can be seen in the background and there's something about it that's just very uncanny. As with most images, the supposed face might be due to pareidolia, but we can't be sure if that's the case. We don't know what exactly is causing us to see this. Therefore, this image remains a mystery. But as always, feel free to share what you think. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> That's one of the craziest text messages to receive, bro. <laughs> that would have messed me up, bro. Especially if I had no kids. Tore that house up. I tore that house up. Get, 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 gotta go. Gotta go. Got to go. <laughs> oh, man. That was crazy, bro. Listen, y'all get at me in the comment section. Let me know what you think, man. And um, whew, that was crazy. Till the next one, I'm gone. Scary Compilations Volumes. 46. Peace.